Now, I've told you a lot of great updates about Wolfpack, and uh, we have won in many states, New Jersey, California, Vermont, Illinois, large states, big states. Uh, we went up against the Koch brothers in New Jersey, and we won. It's not amazing. I thought they were invincible. Now, uh, in New Hampshire, I'd also told you about some good news in the House, and this is amazing. If you don't remember, uh, we won our resolution to get money out of politics through a convention, won 181 to 134 in New Hampshire. More amazing is the bipartisan nature of that vote. 84 Republicans and 97 Democrats all agreed we must get a convention to propose an amendment to get money out of politics. Uh, the state's motto is live free or die. So then we went to the Senate, and you know what happened in the Senate? We won in the Senate, 13 to 11. They said you should go ahead and debate this issue. Now that's the first threshold in the New Hampshire Senate is to be able to debate the issue in the first place. So good news, right? Wrong. See, in New Hampshire, in the Senate side, you need two thirds to be even a to be able to have a debate on the issue. But we weren't allowed to debate it. So now the reason I tell you this is because look, you got to keep it real. <laughs> they don't always throw roses at your feet. The, the process of getting an amendment is not easy. So I've been telling you the good news, and there's been a lot of good news. Even in New Hampshire, look at this, man. Look, we did amazing things in New Hampshire. Remember Valancourt? That was a Republican that opposed us in the House, and uh, he'd been an incumbent there since the 1990s, and we went after him, and we got him out of office. We won in the House. I mean, as bipartisan as it gets, but it ain't easy. If anybody tells you it's easy, trust me, we're working hard, we're in the trenches, we're fighting, we're in every way imaginable. Okay, and, and you, it's not all going to be rainbows and unicorns, but you got to keep fighting. You got to keep fighting. So, look, I, I want to give out shout outs here anyway for the people who did the right thing. First is Senator Andy Sanborn. Now, I'm not going to go through a whole list of people because we didn't have a victory here. We do that when we get victories. And Senator Andy Sanborn is not only a Republican, he's the head of the Rand Paul president. Uh, a campaign uh, for president for campaign in New Hampshire. Now, is he does he agree with us on this issue? I don't know, and I'm not saying that he does. I don't know how he would have voted in the end, but he was a principled guy and said we should have a debate on this issue. That's what we're looking for: principled Republicans and Democrats who say let's have a discussion. And he voted to have that discussion in New Hampshire. I don't know how he would have voted ultimately on the issue, but he did the right thing. He did the principled thing, and for that he should be applauded. Another Republican, uh, this guy is basically an American hero, Jim Rubens, uh, was a former legislator, former state senator in New Hampshire, and uh, he's been fighting for free and fair elections. There's a ton I don't agree with Jim Rubens on, but he believes that money corrupts politics. Of course it does. Most Republicans in New Hampshire believe that, most Republicans in the country believe that, and he represents them. So he fought hard here in New Hampshire, he, he helped on this day, but you got to understand something. We're, you don't stop the fight. And every legislative session you get a little closer. The last time around when we fought in New Hampshire, we didn't win in the House. And you know, we did all the things that I told you about and we won in the House. This time we didn't win in the Senate because we couldn't get two thirds. You think we're done? We're never done, man. We go and we go and we fight. Our state leader there is Nikki DeSalt. I love this. Former dental assistant and mom who's been fighting for two years on the ground in Wolfpack. There's a ton of other great volunteers and organizers in New Hampshire as well, and I can't wait to read their names for you when we win. Okay, you know what Nikki's going to do? You think she's going to fold up tent? No, she's going to keep on fighting. And all those other folks in New Hampshire, whether they're Republicans, Democrats, Libertarians, conservatives, or liberals, we're going to keep on fighting because we've got to get money out of politics. We've got to regain our democracy. Only way you do that is when someone knocks you down, you get back up. If you stay down, that's when you've got real problems. We always get back up at Wolfpack. Come and join us, fight with us, win with us. Let's do it together. Wolf-pack.com. Become a volunteer, become a member, fight in any way you can. Let's go get our democracy back.